I have got no makeup on, so I'm probably definitely getting a filter on this. Not that I care, um, I probably care about 20% to be honest. Um, but this is a video to say that I have decided to do 365 days of no alcohol, um, which is a year, <laughs> for those that don't know. Um, but yeah, I decided to do this, um, uh, in December I decided I was going to do this this year. Um, I haven't, I didn't start until the 29th of January, reason being I was in Ireland, um, at the beginning of January, around the 7th, and then I did actually start after that on the 14th of January, but then like a week later, um, I was doing something really exciting and I just had to like, celebrate with people, um, and it just warranted a celebration. So I had like two drinks that night. So then I was like, okay, fine. You know, I'm only like two weeks into January. I'll start after. So I decided to start on the 29th of January. So now I'm 14 days in to my 365 days. And um, yeah, there's not really any re... Well, yeah, there is a reason. I'm like, there's not really any reason I'm doing it. I guess the reason is to, one, just prove that I can. Like, you know, I'm not an alcoholic or anything. Um, but I do like... <sighs> that sound. If anyone knows that sound. It's not a good sound. Um, but I do like... Um, to, you know, I do binge drink when I go drinking. Um, yeah, you know, like... Yeah those that know know um but um yeah so I just I don't know like I don't I don't want to get deep but after my mum uh died in September 2020 I kind of fell into a massive hole of depression like massive like I just didn't want to live anymore to be honest um and I was in there, I was there for a while, and then I just, um, one day I was like, I need to snap the F out of this, and, you know, I just said to myself, I can either be sad, and my mum is still gone, or I can be happy, and my mum is still gone, so, oh god, what is this in my hair? <laughs> anyway. Um, or I can be sad and my happy and my mum is still gone. Um, and I decided to be happy. You know, obviously I'm still sad about it, but, you know, I'm just trying. So, it's working though. So I just snapped out of it and I decided to get my ass into exercise. So, and just eating well. So that's what I did um, at the beginning of January last year. Um... And yeah, if it wasn't for exercise, I swear to God, I exercise saved me, saved me. Um, so, yeah. So, um, fast forward to 2022, um, I've just decided that, um, well actually last year I quit caffeine because our anxiety levels was just out of this world I couldn't sleep like yeah anyone that's been that's been through grief it's just it's it's not the one um so yeah I decided to quit caffeine which helped my anxiety levels I quit alcohol for five months um which was amazing um and I quit sugar I didn't really like I quit like like you know bags of sugar like putting sugar in my tea and sugar in like my cereal and sugar in I put I quit sugar but obviously there's sugar in everything so I didn't like fully quit sugar but I didn't really eat chocolate and all of that and all of those things were just amazing so fast forward now I just want to um see if I can do a year of no alcohol and I want to try and do six days a week at the gym um just because I'm a lot fitter now like I've joined I joined a boot camp last year that I've been going to now for almost a year and I'm just so much stronger and fitter and I'm just um, wanting to up it to six days a week. I know that realistically I can't really do that every week because I have like a life <laughs> um, but you know I'm going to try and that's the aim. Um, 
so yeah I think that with no alcohol I just want to see what happens to my body because when I quit alcohol and caffeine last year it was amazing like I slept so much better I had no like panic attacks um or just general anxiety feeling you know just anxiety when you're just thinking and your mind's rushing 20 million minutes per hour like that just didn't happen so I've kind of fallen off with the coffee and I've kind of back into caffeine like not every day like I pretty much have caffeine I don't have caffeine more than I have caffeine but I still have it a bit now and when I do have it I f proper feel the effects so I'm trying not to um and yeah so anyway long story short I want to quit alcohol for 365 days and go to the gym four to six times a week so that's the plan and I'm documenting this <laughs> so that I've got accountability so yeah um that's it and along with that obviously I'm getting myself back into singing and music which is just me it's me all over I don't know why I stopped so effort let's do this 2022 I know I'm already like it's already Feb but you know like I'm already 14 days into my no alcohol and the gym you know I've been going to the gym for I don't know I'm probably three weeks into the gym as well like well I go to the gym all the time to be honest but I haven't been doing the six days a week so from I guess now we'll be trying to do the six days a week um so yeah follow my journey <laughs>